Hello everybody. Today was a pretty much a mobility technique kind of day. So don't forget to smile, hold your head up high. That's probably the best thing you can do for your posture. Uh, breathe fully and be aware of the tempo. Be able to speed up your breath and slow it down. So with your training out of the way, I, I, I'd invite you to be aware of what enters your body. Not just your physical body, like your food and uh, drinks. I'm going to be talking mainly about your mental body. What, what, what information enters your mind? You have an information diet, information hygiene. So what media, or what information is entering your mental body and how does that affect you today? And not only how does it affect you today, how will it affect you in 25 years from now? Because things are never one and done. Who are the sources of information, news sources, social media sources? Uh, who are the people you're around? And what do you, what is your, what is your, what do you guys discuss? You could have the same friend and you could talk about scoring drugs and getting high every day. Or you could be talking about uh, doing well at work or at school. The conversation that you participate in is your choice. They say a wise man can learn more from a fool than a fool from a wise man. So when I say how does it affect you today and how does it affect you down the road, because ideas and habits, patterns are never idle. They will inevitably evolve into something far greater than they are today. You grow far, far from baby to uh, whatever stage of life you are in now. There's a big difference in growth. So they evolve with time. It is critical that you realize what current habit, habits uh, of information absorption, what, what current habits of taking in infor- mental hygiene, uh, informational hygiene, studying hygiene, whatever you want to call it, what you allow to enter your mental body from the people, the media, your studies, what it is now. And then what it will become, what you'll let it become. Whether you want it to or whether you're aware of it or not, it will evolve down the road. And that will shape who you become. What fills your mind, what fills your thoughts, you become what you think about. So social media, news, you have full control over that part that you consume, absorb. The people you interact with, that takes a lot more finesse, and I am working on that right now. I think a good author I enjoy is Robert Greene. He has good resources in his books and his social media on how to deal with people, human nature. He's uh, probably my favorite author. So that was my spiel for you, all viewers, today. So if you're doing this uh, split squat right here, you want to squeeze the ground in between your feet. Keep the back leg straight, bend the leg, and use that leg. Your front leg is in front of you, and you're pulling it back. Your back leg is behind you, and you're pulling it forward like a scissors. Like your scissors are pressed against the earth, and you're cutting down. Great for mobility. Knees over toes guy got me into this one. I used to do the toes on the toes, and now I'm into the flat-footed heels down version. Make sure to do them both. I think once I get the benefit out of that, I will get into it. Here are the shoulder stretches. Uh, This is the one I do at night. I do a, a shoulder jump rope stretch shoulder dislocate stretch every day after I take a shower, which is a good time to do that because you often have a towel. 
I was getting some progress from this stretch here before, but now I don't know. I'll just keep going through it to see if it just takes some time to build the, the mobility. Maybe I'll hold on to something to make it easier. I mainly practiced uh, technique in the handstand. Tomorrow and the day after, I'll maybe get into more strength into the legs. I was feeling kind of burnt out from uh, studying and from other things I've been filling my mind with that have been preoccupying, preoccupying me. Here's a great exercise for developing the legs around the knee area. So try it out. Uh, that's all the time I have for today. So thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. Share the video if you want to help somebody else out that might enjoy this. So thank you and bye-bye.